It's July 2022. We are in Game 7 semifinals of the SMS World Cup between the number one player in the world, Pied, and newly mega striker, Luso. Luso has made it here after many rounds of upsets over the likes of Xander G and Banana Steels, while Pied has mowed down all the competition in his path, such as Random Epic Dude and Radical One. Luso is down one goal with seconds remaining in the game and has one last chance to prove to the world and possibly himself that he has what it takes to win it all. If he wins, he will have beaten his greatest bracket demon and get one step closer to his goal. If he loses, his tournament will end in a way that's all too familiar, at the hands of Pied. Welcome to SMS Storybook. These are two familiar faces in the SMS scene. Luso and Pied have faced off many times before, dating all the way back to March 2021, as far back as the first MSL split qualifiers. Luso is set to take on Pied in the second round qualifier, with the winner making top bracket. Wait, is Pied the Waluigi? And Hammer Bros? Gross. Anyway, Pied barely ekes out game one in this best of three matchup after one of the wildest finishes up to that point. Game 2 didn't go as well, with Pied taking the lead early and controlling it the whole way to a victory. Luso falls to the lower bracket while Pied goes to the upper bracket. But not before leaving us with the start of one of the best memes in SMS. No, I went to see the stats. The two would face off in four more matchups in Dolphin Dailies and other various tourneys. Pied swept the matchup leading Luso to an 0-5 record all time. Summer Split comes, and after making it out of Swiss to Bracket, who would be Luso's first round? Well, Pied of course, and yet another run ended by Pied, 0-6. After the World Cup drawing, Luso has his work cut out for him with a round one matchup against Protagonist G, who brought him to the brink of elimination in Consolation Cup. It was a much different story this time around, 4-0. Round 2, he's walking into the heavily favored Banana Steals and walking away the victor in an upset, 4-2. The challenges just keep coming as he's pitted against Xander G and once again walking away the victor, 4-2. Pied has been running through the competition on his way to the semifinals. Not dropping a single game to any of his three opponents, beating Big Daddy, Radical One, and Random Epic Dude, 4-0 apiece. Game 1, Luso comes out in full control throughout the entire game. Until... Disaster strikes. With the last second dinker, Pied is able to steal away Game 1, 1-0. Game 2, Luso takes Pied to the Palace. Pied scores a goal in the first 30 seconds. And another... And another. 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 Oh wait, is that a mid-game stats check? And another. And another. Holy shit. It's 11-0. A record at Palace at the time, and Pied is up 2-0 with the pressure mounting. Game 3, Pied is in complete control, cruising to a 7-2 win. At least he didn't hit double digits, right? Down 3-0, what can Luso do to stop Pied's momentum? Take Pied's peach, of course. Luso takes Game 5, 5-3, marking the first time that someone has taken Pied's peach and not paid dearly for it. On top of that, Luso becomes the first player to take a game off Pied in World Cup. But still down 3-1, Pied takes him to underground. The game is close throughout, but Luso takes the lead off of a rebound to take game 5 with the immediate run back. Yet another game that's close, with Luso once again coming up clutch and scoring with 20 seconds to go, eventually leading Luso to take game 6. Luso has clawed back into this series. Game 7 is another underground game. Luso opens the scoring with a rebound. 
shortly after, he creates a breakaway and scores the slide shot. Later, Lusso sinks a dinker, putting him up 3-0 in this game 7. The kickoff turnover by Pied gives Lusso a free corner in which he sinks, giving him a 4-0 lead. But it's Pied's turn to claw his way back into the game. And after a lob, a perfect pass, a slide, and a rebound, Pied has tied it up at 4. But Pied is not done as the double perfect pass gives him the lead. Luso's not done either as he sinks another dinker tying it up once again. With under 20 seconds left, Pied scores a lob to take the lead. And now we're here. These two have brought each other to the brink, exchanging clutch shots in not only this game, but many of the previous games as well. Luso has clawed his way back into the series and just needs one more goal. If he wins, he will take his first win off of Pied in his career. If he loses, it will be yet another loss and tournament ended by Pied. Welcome to a moment in SMS history. With the, like he got the early shot. Yeah. Oh gosh, he's got so one rush have here. An opportunity here. He has bombs and he has something to work with. Here. Oh my goodness. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Corner shot falls. Oh my god. Lusa, last second comeback here. 